If you want an easy way to buy cheaper Rocket League items no matter what console you're on, head over to RL Exchange and use code DILWOBS at checkout for 3% off. It's a super easy site to use and there's a bunch of different payment methods that you can also use. And my favorite part is that they constantly run giveaways that you can enter by doing different tasks on the site. So make sure if you're buying things from RL Exchange, you also check out the giveaways tab because I know you guys love your free items. So why not do that? There's a link in the description that will get you all set up and hopefully you can enjoy buying some nice Rocket League items. Yo, what's going on guys? Double here and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. Now in this video, just a quick update, the new, well not new, but the Jurassic World bundle is returning to Rocket League today. So in the item shop, if you go over to the Jurassic World section, you will see three options. Now you can either buy the T-Rex Gold Explosion on its own, or you can buy the Jeep Wrangler bundle, which includes the Jeep Wrangler, um, and it looks like this in blue and red. Uh, the Jurassic Park hard hat, which you can see there, and then just these antennas that I'm showing you now. The antennas are all right, but like, we don't really care about them. And the banners, I do like this banner here. Uh, this banner here, if it was animated, it would be cooler, but otherwise, I'm not a huge fan of that. So you can buy that separately for 800, or the goal explosion, which you can see here, for 800. This is one that I know a lot of people love. Um, or you can buy them both for only 1,100. So if you've not got any of them, you might as well get the one with both. Um, but if you see yourself just buying one, let me know, because I want to see what people do if you buy both or if you buy just one. But remember, if you are buying, make sure you support code DILBOBSYT in the item shop, and um, that will renew every 14 days. So make sure you update it. But there we go. That is literally it. I honestly knew that they'd bring out the goal explosion as its own separate thing. I did think it would cost 800, but I saw a comment actually on my previous video where I showed some concepts of what painted versions would look like. If you haven't seen that, go and check it out because I think it's really cool. But someone in that did actually say they think it will be worth 800 credits. So um, they were actually completely right. So there you go. That is this mini update with this bundle. And that comes to the end of all the sort of returning bundles coming back to Rocket League all throughout this summer. Um, and this will be in the item shop till the 28th of July, I believe. However, don't get too disheartened because that means we have new DLCs coming soon in the future, including the James Bond Aston Martin DB5 DLC, which obviously is a brand new DLC, and that should be out late August, early September. It's a leaked item that I found in the game files, if you didn't have any idea how I just came up with that. Yeah, so we're going to be getting a James Bond DLC next, which is awesome. But there we go. And also in this little update, um, if you go to casual and play Rocket Labs, there is a mode where essentially there's two sort of circles in the floor, either side of the pitch, and you just score in them. It's pretty boring game mode. I am not a huge fan. If I were to play it in sort of a more 1v1 or 2v2 scenario, I think it would be better. But it's a 3v3 game mode, so it's, um, it's not the greatest, honestly. It's a bit too hectic and... Um, it's just not all that fun, if I'm honest. The ball has to be going either really slow or it has to be like a swish, like sort of dunk to get it into the floor. So if you're with your friends and like you've got a nice group of people to play with, it's all right. But if you're just solo queuing, it ain't that fun. But anyway, that's it from me. A quick one this time because there's not loads in that bundle. Nothing new to talk about anyway. But that's it from me. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.